Hi, welcome to MMA Made Easy, where we break hard techniques in easy chunks. Today we're going to be going from the uh, wrestler's clinch to the back clinch. So, I'm here, uh, I probably landed at least one shot here, and then what I want to do is pull so that uh, his arm is going this way versus this way, okay? If I make him go this way, then he's going to be inclined to kind of move in a circular motion. Whereas what I want is more of a man motion like this. Now the reason this works so well is if I just hit him here, oh, and then I go like this, chances are he's thinking, oh, I'm going to hit him again in the same spot. Okay, so he's going to want to be bringing his arm down like this. Okay, so from there, bang, as he's coming down, I can very easily just come around to the back, either grabbing under double unders or over under or anything like that to get behind them, okay? It's a way to collapse their body and take away any of the obstructions. So I'm here, switch, hit, pull up, and they'll do it for you, and then from there, uh, you are behind them, okay? The real key is, you gotta feel the resistance. So if you're uh, being pulled like this, and they pull you up, and you feel no resistance, then you need them again. Okay, then they will give you resistance, okay? As soon as they do this though, that's when you can very easily bypass and take the back because they're doing it for you. They're doing this, Hulkamania, uh, they're doing this motion for you. <laughs>